Hello dear friends, here I have some of these, uh, just learn some new trick, or oh, dog learn some new trick, I found it, it's quite, uh, it's quite cool, so let's try to do it together. So this one you will have, uh, this one is called Twist Rose, you can find uh, instruction on, online, just search the word Twist rose rose flower with twist so you make one ugly taco and then on the other side you make another ugly taco we always say it's ugly taco because it's uh, the, the not a significant color on the outside now you turn it around to make a pretty a good looking a color for um, hot dog and then on the other side another hot dog after you have done this you try to fold it together to make a small square and then there is one point forget about it there are many many points this is the right direction fold in here on the other side also fold in origami is symmetric you do on one side then you do on the other side so fold in right to the center and here also right to the center now you need to open it up Usually at this time, open up. You cannot find the line, it's not e so easy. So it's better to make a line here. So you can fold a little bit here. And actually it needs to be on this side also, so you can fold it just to, for a line to make sure where you want to turn. So now you want to lift this page up and open up its mouth so you can come to see this line here okay this line here so on two sides it will be symmetric voila so on the back side will be the same thing here is the line you open it up, press it strong so that you know where the line is going to be. Well, this one is not so bad. I usually fail on this part. So now you lift up, you can see here there is a top and on the bottom there are two little legs, like a ballet leg. This is right, okay? I use the same as me. Here is a top and two legs and open up. Then you turn it one time and press it straight and then lift your leg up and then totally turn it over and lift the other leg up. No, uh, not yet. Totally turn it over and then you turn this one over. And now we will completely lift this up. It becomes like this. This one will become actually origami bird. A lot of uh, a lot of uh, crane, a lot of tsuru, a lot of uh, origami comes from here and here what we do we press this one this line come to here and here is a side line so we put it here voila so at the end you want to make something like this like like this so you do here and then this one is the same thing 
you will need to do this and this one press it down and you need to change to here I still not yet totally figured it out how it is done and press it flat and now it's all good now the magic has all happened okay what we are going to do is now it becomes like this now we are going to turn it over make it pretty okay turn it over and then put it right into the center into the center the tip the top into the center the tip the top into the center the tip the top into the center okay so this is roughly the <coughs> the the rows so you can turn a little bit and become a rose and actually it does not look so much like a rose i feel and they say it's a rose and i feel it's a line Okay, they say this one is a rose. I don't think it's a rose because the the tip is too sharp. I'm sorry, it must be lost, out of focus. So you can press it, press it, make it more rounded shape, right? This way is more rounded shape. Make this a sharp edge, more rounded more rounded bend bend in so on the back you can see it bends in or the edge make it make it less sharp make it more rounded okay so this one we are done here we can also do round it up round it up here round it up it does not have to be perfect flower leaves petals are not perfect okay this one is better now we need to press it down a little bit so this one is a rose I do not know why I always cannot make the rose stands. Stands well. This one is a rose like this. It's better to let it slant it a little bit. And I always feel this one on top is too much. So press it down. Just press it down like this. Looks a little bit natural. Or you can press it then press it down I feel this one is better just to make it use your hand to bend it a little bit looks I feel this one better I don't know how do you think Okay, this is a rose. I'm still, I still want to try something different. Let me have some cool color. I want to have some cool. Um, <clears throat> just do some freehand cutting. Maybe I will do another video. Is that too long?
Maybe this is not a good idea. This is not a good idea. I will not do this. And um, <clears throat> here is another flower if you like to see. And uh, I need to find this flower on the on the internet. It is relatively quite easy a flower. It's nothing difficult, but uh, the point is that uh, it can be quite confusing. And uh, you just need to to find the 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 the. the um, the uh, instruction and uh, I found on the internet there was one lady geometric flower origami, origami. I think uh, this lady her name is Layla or something no, origami, just origami. Maybe we will find geometric. It was a very pretty origami flower. Let me try origami flower. Mm -hmm. So many pretty flowers. That's origami flower or origami pin. Well, there are so many pretty flowers. The more you do, the more you want to make it more um, more lively and um, and uh, and. Uh, and more fun and uh, and different. You will be. I like this roast. Cannot find it for now. I forgot. I started to cry. Da 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 da. Da di da di da di da di da di da di da 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 Anyway, this one I have uh, posted onto my blog site, so we can we can take a look here. So you will 
need a piece of paper so you will do you will do like, like a pretty taco oh no an ugly taco and the ugly taco ugly hamburger everything is ugly okay. another ugly hot dog and after that you are going to put to the center you will have to do this and this. You will put your paint.